I also wanted to know a little about the analysis you did on certificate programs. So if you can tell us a little bit, a little bit more about that, that would be helpful. Yeah, so that's uh, a, a growing audience, people that want to get a certificate. So I just mentioned that you might have a degree in something, but you want to get a professional certificate in data science or cloud architecture or GIS. That's what we offer at bootcampgis.com. And I wanted to uh, examine all of the GIS certificate programs out there in the country. And there's about a hundred of them. Um, only about 10% of them are online. And most of them teach a pretty um, set, uh, a common set of classes that are general in nature. Um, they've taught those for decades and that's the exposure to the geography and GIS um, industry and thought processes. So classes like that might be intro to cartography, intro to remote sensing, intro to GIS analysis, um, intro to GIS databases. That's the core set. So those are great classes to have, um, but you might find that you're, um, you'll experience a skills gap, meaning you take those classes and you still don't have quite enough skills to get uh, outcompete somebody else for a job in the industry because in industry, the skills required um, get even more specific than those general classes. So like processing data imagery from UAV or um, learning to create 3D elevation models from LIDAR uh, or creating an application out on the web in AWS. Those are things that you might go back and get your certificate and um, finding um, a program that actually teaches those would be the best return on investment for you. 